of viewers welcome to engineer has civil engineer in this video i am going to explain you about crop rotation well most of you are aware of crop rotation but in this video i am going to explain the definition and also what is the necessity of crop rotation and along with that i am going to give you some best crop rotation combinations also and if you find my video useful please hit like button and you can subscribe my channel engineer hash if we look at the definition of crop rotation it states the nature of the crop sown in a particular field is changed season after season it suggests you to if we sow crop x in season 1 it suggests you to change to crop y in season 2 but what is the necessity of crop rotation why we have to follow crop rotation practice because if we keep on utilizing the same crop on and on in a particular field three things get affected one the fertility of the soil gets reduced and the crops are vulnerable to insects and diseases and last one is we cannot completely utilize the soil nutrients if we follow the same cropping pattern every year let's see how crops are called autotrophs because they have an ability to synthesize their own food the crops absorb few nutrients like nitrogen phosphorus and potassium which is present in the soil but each and every plant absorb the same nutrients nitrogen phosphorus and potassium but their proportions vary so if we we sow a crop x every time if crop x needs more nitrogen it will completely deplete the nitrogen present in that soil so the soil fertility seriously gets affected if we consider the second point uh, if a particular crop is deficient of some x nutrient its ability to defend insects and diseases reduces drastically so if we follow crop rotation pattern this reduces the vulnerability of the crops to get affected with diseases and insects and next one is utilization of soil nutrients different crops have different root depths if we consider this this has deeper roots this has shallow roots if we keep on utilizing this crop a which has deeper roots it absorbs nutrient from the lower part of the soil strata so this part of the soil will be depleted with the nutrients and this part remains in excess so if we change crop rotation pattern the soil nutrients gets completely utilized so this is the necessity of crop rotation and next we have best crop rotation combinations they are here we have five wheat great millet and gram rice and gram cotton wheat and sugar cane cotton wheat and gram cotton great millet and gram these are some important crop rotation combinations here in most of the cases we find gram 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 why is it so let's see the role of gram in crop rotation combinations grams and beans are called leguminous crops leguminous crops have nitrogen fixing bacteria growing on their roots what this nitrogen fixing bacteria do is it absorbs atmospheric nitrogen and supply it to the soil they absorb the nitrogen in the atmosphere and they supply it to, to the soil in a way they are replenishing the soil fertility so this leguminous crops play a very important role in crop rotation combinations if you find my video useful 
please hit like button you can subscribe my channel engineer hash thank you for watching this video